Good evening and thank you for joining us tonight. The Florida Department of Health says a cyber attack is causing problems across the state of Florida. Officials confirmed thieves hacked into the state's vital statistics system, which processes birth and death certificates. Since the attack, those systems have been inaccessible. WEAR's Brent Carney reports this is causing quite the backup at funeral homes. At this point, funeral homes can't help families grieving until they have that death certificate. And until that system is fixed, those families are going to continue to wait. It literally puts us in a bad spot because we have zero control over it. Funeral home director Chris Jensen says he's one of the more than 6,000 funeral homes across Florida impacted by last week's hack. It brought his operation to a standstill. We get numerous phone calls, probably, you know, 10 a day. The hack shut out funeral homes and other offices from accessing the Department of Health's vital statistics system. Everything's in there. It affects birth certificates, it affects death certificates, all the information is in there. Funeral homes like Family Funeral and Cremation now have to handwrite certificates and deliver them to the doctor's offices and the Department of Health. That hasn't been done since the system went digital. Typically speaking, it takes four to five days to get a death certificate, now it's two to three weeks. So we send it to the health department, or we actually have to hand carry most of them nowadays. We send it over there, they don't allow anything faxed. So they want all the originals. So I've actually had to hire a runner, does nothing but ride around all day delivering these to the doctors and back to the medical examiner and then over to the health department. The District 1 Medical Examiner's Office says death certificates are now being done by hand on paper. They say several death certificates started in the computer system did not get finished before the hack. Those cannot be accessed and finished until the hack has been fixed. I spoke to one PACE woman who says they're now delaying funeral arrangements until this is sorted out. Well, I hope it gets solved soon because I, like me and so many other families, we're in a holding pattern because we can't get any of the legal paperwork, anything done as far as their estates, nothing, none of their banking, nothing can be done without a death certificate. And some funeral homes say that the access does get better by the day, but there's no word on when this cyber attack could be fixed. In the studio, Brent Carney, WER News.